welcome back to our channel. This is Kriya Contractor from Disha Education Consultancy. I hope you all are doing well and I am making this video after a very long time as I was very busy during my online counseling sessions. So today I decided that I will make a video banaungi, a comparison between Russia and Georgia. Because we have a lot of students aate hai and they ask ma'am to go to Russia. Jana hai. But they don't know what is the reality and how to compare two countries. Because students are confused and you know, parents are confused as well. Where to go, how to go. So today you will be getting a clear idea about two countries where I will be comparing from the fee structure regarding the country. Everything will be compared in these two countries. So starting with the video. So the first topic is K duration kya rehta hai? Russia may be our MBBS six years ka rehta hai and same is with Georgia ke waha pe bhi six years ka hi MBBS hota hai. So but there is a twist in it. Ke Georgia may five plus one ka system follow kiya jata hai. Yani ki you have an option of doing your internship in your home country or in Georgia. You don't get that option in Russia. Aapko completely six years wahi pe padai karna padta hai. And the next thing will be K like what is the country, kaha pe hai country. First of all, dono ek European countries hai. Both of the countries are located in Europe only. The other thing is K weather like you major sare parents ka concern hota hai ki weather kaisa hai. To jab hum Russia ke weather ki baat karte hai, to Russia ka weather range karta hai 30 degree Celsius se leke minus 35 degree. Yes, you heard it right. It is minus 35 degree. यानि कि ठंडी बहुत है रशिया में। When we compare to Georgia, तो Georgia का जो weather है, that is around 25 degree Celsius से लेके minus two minus three तक काफी moderate climate रहता है for Indian students because they are habituated, basically हमारे जो North Indians होते हैं, they are habituated with minus two minus three degree Celsius, so that won't be an issue for them. The next is safety. जब भी कोई भी बच्चा अपने पेरेंट्स से दूर जाता है तो सारे पेरेंट्स को रहता है कि हमारा बच्चा कोई अलग कंट्री में जा रहा है अकेला रहने वाला है तो सेफ्टी कैसा है कंपेयरिंग द सीपीआई इंडेक्स दैट इज द करप्शन परसेप्शन इंडेक्स ऑफ 2019 जॉर्जिया रैंक्स 44 यानी कि यू कैन कंसीडर दैट करप्शन इज नल एज वेल एज देयर इज नो क्राइम रेट एंड नो टेररिज्म वेयर इज रशिया स्टैंड्स ओनली 125th नंबर and India, जब हम India से comparison करते हैं, तो India stands on 98, Georgia is 44 and Russia is 125. Now you can compare कि students को कहाँ जाना चाहिए if we consider safety as our first priority. The other thing is safety wise index जो रहता है, उसमें Georgia is listed as the sixth safest country among the other like you know more than there are more than hundred countries. But Georgia is listed as the sixth safest country across the globe. Whereas Russia is listed as 144. Yes, like our India is also Russia behind Russia. So, like the parents who are like that, that our safety is a major concern. I will be you know, suggesting them that you should consider both of these factors. So the Corruption Perception Index as well as the Safety Index. The other would be that like what is the syllabus pattern, examination pattern, language These are all questions in our students' minds are all the So first of all, medium of instruction In Georgia, the medium of instruction would be fully English Six years, you have to study fully English medium in English Whereas in Russia, all you know is that it is a bilingual country So it might happen that you know you have to study three years of your curriculum in English and the other three years in Russian. Yes, this is the reality. Okay, like 90 to 95% of the universities follow these patterns. Like they use uh, 3 to 3 ratio or 4 is to 2. Okay, 4 years of English mein padai karenge, but 2 years Russian. Because it is a bilingual country, Russia may Russian language seekhna is compulsory. You don't have any option kya wo language nahi seekhenge. If you don't learn that language, you cannot survive in that country. As well as aapki padhai bhi aadhi Russian mein hi hone wali. The other thing is K entrance exam. Georgia mein aapko sirf need qualify karna rehta hai, koi entrance exam nahi rehta hai. But when we compare it with Russia, Russia mein aapko entrance exam dena padega. Most of the universities have entrance exam and some of them don't. 
बट इट इज लाइक दैट कि अगर आपको देना है सम ऑफ यूनिवर्सिटीज टेक इट फॉर जैसे नो फॉर ग्रांटेड लाइक आपको कंपल्शन नहीं है कि यू हैव टू क्लियर इट ओनली देन यू गेट एडमिशन बट सम यूनिवर्सिटीज टेक इट वेरी सीरियसली कि वंस यू गेट योर एडमिशन लेटर एंड इफ यू पे योर फीस एंड देन यू डोंट क्लियर योर एग्जाम देन यू वोट बी एबल टू गो एनी वेयर यू हैव टू स्टे इन योर होम कंट्री क्लियर एंट्रेंस एग्जाम एंड देन एंड देन ओनली यू कैन गो टू रशिया फॉर योर एम so this is like you know a drawback thing for the students who doesn't want to give any additional exam for going for a video abroad the other thing will be case syllabus kaisa hai georgia mein there are four universities which are following us ml syllabus that is the united states medical licensing examination syllabus whereas in russia people and like most in georgian universities also they follow european syllabus and in uh, russia as well they follow the european syllabus which is similar both of these universities follow the ects system that is the 3 credit 360 credit system so it is similar but the four universities which i will be more emphasizing on is the us mle based syllabus because that will be covered in the next point it is the fmge passing ratio ये सबसे लाइक यू नो कंसर्न क्वेश्चन रहता है स्टूडेंट्स का कि वंस वी गो आउट देन व्हाट विल बी आर एफ एम जी रेशियो लाइक वापस आने के बाद हमें काफी सारे स्टूडेंट्स को सिर्फ इंडिया वापस आना है तो उन्हें कंसर्न रहता है कि व्हाट इज द पासिंग रेशियो सो जॉर्जा का पासिंग रेशियो इज अराउंड फिफ्टी परसेंट से लेके एटी परसेंट तक डिपेंडिंग ऑन द यूनिवर्सिटीज एंड इफ यू गो इन टू यूनिवर्सिटी विच इज फॉलोइंग यूएस एम एल सिलेबस देन देर पासिंग रेशियो इज हंड्रेड परसेंट Yes, it is 100% because US MLA से ऊपर कोई सिलेबस नहीं है सो मीन्स यू स्टडी दैट लेवल ऑफ सिलेबस एनी एग्जामिनेशन इफ यू हैव टू गिव इट इज वेरी इजी फॉर यू वेर इज इन रशिया द पासिंग रेशियो इज अराउंड टेन टू फोर्टी परसेंट अराउंड आप कह सकते हैं कि कुछ यूनिवर्सिटीज हैं एक दो विच यू नो गेट द रिजल्ट अप टू फोर्टी परसेंट बाय बाकी सब गेट्स फ्रॉम टेन टू ट्वेंटी के बीच में उनका पासिंग रेशियो रहता है इवन यू कैन चेक द एफ एम जी पासिंग रेशियो रिपोर्ट ऑफ टू थाउजेंड नाइनटीन फ्रॉम वेट आई गेट दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन यू कैन क्रॉस वेरीफाई इफ यू वॉन्ट द सब्जेक्ट्स इन जॉर्जिया दिस इट इज अ पार्टिशन के लाइक टू पॉइंट फाइव ईयर बेसिक साइंसेस के आप सब्जेक्ट्स पढ़ेंगे नेक्स्ट टू पॉइंट फाइव ईयर्स में यू बी स्टडिंग योर क्लिनिकल साइंसेस के सब्जेक्ट्स सो देर इज नो एडिशनल लाइक जॉर्जियन सब्जेक्ट्स और एनीथिंग बट इन रशिया यू हैव टू स्टडी फॉर थ्री ईयर्स उनका हिस्ट्री उनका कल्चर उनका इकोनॉमिक्स बायो एथिक्स रशियन लैंग्वेज ये सारे आपके एडिशनल सब्जेक्ट्स हैं तो जो भी बच्चे सोच रहे हैं कि कोई कंसल्टेंट आपको कह रहा है कि रशिया जाना चाहिए आपको रशियन लैंग्वेज नहीं पढ़ना है कल्चर नहीं पढ़ना है गो थ्रू देर करिकुलम फर्स्ट बिकॉज काफी सारे स्टूडेंट्स ऐसे आते हैं कि उन्हें लाइक फर्स्ट टू ईयर्स में ठीक है उन्हें लाइक इंग्लिश में पढ़ाया जाता है एंड देन देस कि नेक्स्ट ईयर से रशियन में पढ़ाया जाएगा बट उन्हें कंसल्टेंट इन्फॉर्म नहीं करते एंड इट इज आर रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी दैट हम आपको पूरा सच बताएं ऐसा नहीं है कि लाइक अभी हम आपको भेजने के लिए भेज देते हैं दैट इज नॉट वॉट वी डू सो आई एम लाइक टेलिंग यू गाइज इफ यू वॉन्ट टू गो टू रशिया इट इज अ वेरी गुड कंट्री जस्ट मेक श्योर यू रेफर एवरी You should know your curriculum before you leave India. वहाँ पे आपको Russian language के साथ साथ you have to learn their culture, economics, history. Everything is taught over there in Russian. Whether it is related to MBBS or not, but you have to study that because you are studying in their country. It is their rule. The next point would be like the scholarship. Like काफी सारे हमारे बच्चे होते हैं जिन्हें scholarship नहीं हो, they want scholarship. So yes, Georgia universities offer you scholarships from second year. It is from 25% to 100% depending on the score you get. But in Russia, you don't have an option of scholarships. They don't provide scholarships because they're all government universities. They don't provide scholarship to any students, especially to international students, faculties. Georgia mein you get English speaking faculties. All the faculties are very fluent in English. Even in you know. Uh, see their videos where they are speaking in english it is quite you know it feels like you are not talking to some other foreigner or something it, you can understand their english very well whereas in russian the teachers might face a little bit of you know barrier when you speak with them in english because they are more fluent in russian language so language would be a like you know a big barrier in russia compared to georgia and the next point comes are hostel and mess so hostel in georgia you will get our own you know hostel facilities of disha education consultancy and 
we provide Indian mess to students, we provide North Indian, South Indian food to our students and they can get giant food if they want. Every facility is given in Georgia. In Russia, you have to cook your own food. It is up to you if you want to like you know avail Indian mess. We don't guarantee that it will be that good. But in Russia, you can cook your own food. Mostly students who are staying in Russia cook their own food. But we suggest that if you are going to MBBS like studying, which is a great thing in itself, then you should not, you know, you cannot waste your time in cooking your own food. Ultimately, you are tired and then you cannot study and that cannot happen in MBBS. You have to study a lot. So, we suggest our students that you take a mess, eat it, eat it, eat it, eat it, make sure you get good food. Because that is you know very important for your schedule and everything. The last point that I'll be covering is that fee structure. So Georgia may can get fee structure of four thousand to eight thousand dollars, which is very affordable. When we talk about Russia, you can get the fee structure starting from two thousand to ten thousand dollars. But अगर आपको चाहिए कि आपको fully English medium university चाहिए and अच्छी university चाहिए तो उसका fee structure start होता है six thousand dollars से लेके ten thousand dollars तक क्योंकि सारे concerns आपको कहेंगे कि two thousand three thousand dollars काफी cheap है रशिया but they are not teaching fully in English medium they follow the pattern of three to three or four to four which is not good for our students because उन्हें India के FMG का exam देना है but now it's not FMG, so next but next we will have to clear them and that will be in English, not in Russian language that is the reason that Russia's FMG passing ratio is so low because students can't clear them there are a lot of students who are studying there and then they don't understand them there are a lot of things that they face so it is a wise decision you guys should clarify all the points you should think about all the factors that I have discussed today एक सारे फैक्टर्स को इवैल्यूएट करिए सोचिए कि क्या बेस्ट है आपके लिए एंड वी आर देयर टू हेल्प यू इन एवरी एस्पेक्ट यू जस्ट नीड टू कॉल अस वी विल गाइड यू फॉर एवरीथिंग फॉर एवरी कंट्री सो या दिस वाज ऑल अबाउट कंपैरिजन बिटवीन रशिया एंड जॉर्जिया and if you want that I should make more videos then please like, share and subscribe and put your comment, you know, the topic in the comment box and I'll surely make a video about it. And if you want any help regarding anything or if you want an online counseling session, just give us a call. We'll revert you back in 24 hours. Thank you.